you haven't seen, I recently won one million dollars across a lot of different game shows. And now it's time to do what any good millionaire does. Buy up all the property in an area and drive up the rent! Hooray! That's right, I'm becoming a I'm becoming a landlord on today's stream, and we're gonna look at Zillow Gone Wild to look at the most eccentric properties in the neighborhood. Alright. We're gonna look at Zillow Gone Wild and look at some of the craziest houses on the internet, shall we? I don't know what's going on here, but it's five hundred thousand dollars. Let's find out. <laughs> Is this a pool? Uh, I don't know. There's no way out. It's just a long room with a low ceiling. It's a death trap. A game room. Awesome. A little lumpy. <laughs> Looks like a like a like an English pub from the 1600s. Oh, hell yeah! Here we go! The captain's den! I'm the captain, by the way. Nobody touch me wheel. I be driving the house. Wait, wait this is the door, because it says welcome. This is where you come in? Wait, there's a window there. Imagine walking your dog on this street. Is that a fucking pirate wheel? There's some scalawags in there. House for sale outside of St. Louis, Missouri. Looks normal to me, right? <laughs> Boom, Pee Wee's Playhouse. That shit, 60s as hell. All right, not a bad fireplace. This is certainly an eccentric person, sure. Oh, this hurts my eyes. I was down for the door, like an old Nickelodeon cartoon. This, this is too many colors. You got the red and the blue and then the gold ceiling. Is that a TV above the fridge? Who's watching TV there? <laughs> okay. A lot of uh, hard stuff in this bathroom. Like, you don't fall. You're gonna bang your head and die. There's a lot of stuff that could fall and hurt you here. It's like a rock climbing wall. Imagine you get shampoo in your eye in this room. You would die. You would run into the puffer fish or the crab and just die. Because you wouldn't be able to see. If I don't get this house, I will literally die. It's like a Wednesday Adams house. You might die by getting the house. Yeah, this shit's haunted. This shit's definitely haunted. That's the whole house? That's it? This house will kill you. This house is cursed and will kill you. The paintings come alive at night. Those are bosses, Coney? Oh, my bad. If you have to complete the ritual, this is a great house. Oh, who do I have to kill next? Oh, St. Paul. You kill him, and then he's not he's erased from the uh, from the window. Yeah, okay, yeah. Wiley stage select. You have to jump into each portrait, complete the boss rush. Okay, sure, yeah. I decided to only post a few pics because you have to see the whole thing. <laughs> Okay, let's open it up, shall we? 15-acre Kansas estate with network of underground scuba tunnels. This will kill you. This is a Hitman property, absolutely. Great place, yup, this is looking like it might be our house. God, this guy is rich, rich. Generational wealth. They got an indoor grotto, dude? <laughs> Where does this go? Oh, the enchanted library. Okay, yeah, sure. Th this just makes me sad. This is cool as hell. I will never be this rich. Oh my god, what the fuck is this conspiring ass room? This is a room where you stage a coup. It's a glass gazebo? The Jedi Senate. Another kitchen. Yup, the attic. Where's the scuba tunnels? Game room. Okay, with a theater. There's a fucking castle? For you to put your your daughter to lock her away? It's in Lock Lloyd. Dude, what they have an in cave. Dining area. Why do rich people get to have all the money, bro? How come I can't have any money? Oh, hell yeah, a school. I love these. 131,000 square foot school for 225K. We could we could literally be there tomorrow. Let's get a school, guys. There's a water fountain for any of my thirsties in chat. Here we go, big ass room. This is our rumpus room. We can all play, right? A lot of activities. We can have a trophy case. Hey, every night I stream. Put it in the auditorium. Everybody can I can't together. We can't. Everybody in here together laughing at the same stuff. There's even a bio lab so we can conduct experiments. This could be on the new chatters. Yes, first time chatter. Welcome to the stream. Come right this way. <laughs> Into the bio lab. The first photo of the inside caught me off guard. I'd say the outside is kind of abstract too. This is like a Sims house. The last time we did this, there was a house with all the animals. What's on the inside? <laughs> Chat, that looks kind of cool. <laughs> Me first, though. I want to go for it. I'm going down the spinny one. Wee! Okay, this I get. What is this for? This is like a RoboCop set. Yeah, but what's happening here? 
Crime? Resident Evil. I joined this sub just to share this house. All right. Looks pretty good. Okay, let's go inside. Okay. Weird color palette, but it looks... It looks kind of... Wait, it's just a big circle house. Okay. <laughs> okay. We could just dial back the colors a little bit. I mean, I like the circular idea, the, the vision. It's like a sniper tower, you know what I mean? Like, you see threats on all sides. That's kind of neat, I guess. Don't know why we need all these colors there. It's like a circus tent. Wait, is this it? Where's the house? D oh! <laughs> oh, it's a chamber. Okay. I can't tell- Oh! <laughs> oh, I see. It's a very tall tower house. You're gonna die. This will definitely snap your ankle. Are you serious? This rules, though. I love that. I want to live there. If I could jump from my shower to my bed and do a swanton into bed, fuck yeah, dude. <laughs> this is a trap. That deck is a one-way level transition. This deck is the point of no return. If you go through that door, I hope you have a manual save. Because you can't get back. You better have gotten every collectible in that room. <laughs> it's bending. Did he do it just to piss off the other guy? Is that the same house? I was gonna say, if that's like a duplex, and the other guy is like, yep, just got my new red deck installed, and this guy's like, oh yeah? I'm gonna put my shit higher. Send it up! How are we gonna secure it? Two screws! For $700,000, you can live next door to the Green Bay Packers. <laughs> oh, cool! Well, Mom, I'm gonna go to the game! Just bike on over, right there, walk even. You ever want a snack, overpriced beer, Bud Light, just head on over to the stadium. Mid-century modern gem. I'll be the judge of that. Ooh, a table with a pole in it. Do you guys know you can get a house with an indoor pool in it in Florida for like $300,000? I guess the trade-off is like you're in Florida and you'll be underwater in a decade, but that's crazy to me. That I, get, I When I'm old, I'm going to go there. If it's still there, okay, big ass, do oh, I love that. Something about wavy architecture gets me. I like that. When the shit got some curves in it, I could sit right there and have my breakfast on my left and my lunch on my right, and I don't have to move all day. Cut myself running to post this. Oh my god. This is what Oscar the Grouch's house looks like. When he goes in the can, this is it. Ran out of materials? He had to build it out of aluminum? <laughs> Big Bad Wolf happy as shit right now. You better not piss off a wolf. He's gonna huff and puff. This house is going down immediately. I don't see a single brick on the property. Anyone have 1.45 million for this 1900 home? Ooh, hold on. Okay. Big ass mansion. Something about square mansions that I like. Oh, it's just a big ass fancy house. Nothing funny about it. They got the rich people fridge. See that right there? The sliding door? Good heavens. They got steel gunner? <laughs> Only steel gunner? Why? <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> That's the weirdest thing. Why? Of all the get, like, wh I would think, like, House of the Dead or Time Crisis. Like, if you gotta pick a light gun game, that's the only thing in the house. Like, there's furniture and toilets and a uh, game room, I guess. And then Steel Gunner by Namco. Cabinet Fever. Hold on. <laughs> oh, good heavens. All right. How many cabinets? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. How do you even get up there? It's like The Sims and you stacked it too high, but you don't know the undo button. Ah, oh, shit, whatever. Just leave it up there. A lot of clue houses tonight, yeah. One of these is definitely, like, a portal. <laughs> One of these will take you to another area of the house, like Mario 64. <laughs> oh, my God, there's more. <laughs> no, but those aren't cabinets. Oh, my God, they're cabinets. I thought those were just... Well, they're maybe they're just window blinds. That makes it worse. It's a false cabinet. Oh my god, not more. I thought the kitchen was the only place. Why in the bathroom? You don't need to go up there. The average height in this family must be like 6'8". God, you know what? This might be our house. If you guys are okay with living in cabinets, you could stuff you in there. Everybody could have their own little cabinet where they could live. I see what Coney means about Metroid level design now. Yeah, everybody that was praising Metroid and saying they wouldn't get lost. Imagine a Metroid game in this house. Then what do you do? Find the missile power up, shithead. You won't. The house that cocaine built. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it looks very exorbitant to... Ah, I see. Okay, I get it. Bojack ass house. You have two separate dining tables. Okay. For two different parties going on. A double-layered couch. Do you ever have that many people over? 
This dude is entertaining. Two stoves. Ah, the study. Okay, yes, got it. This is a very important man with very important business. Is this the bedroom? This is Jason Bateman. Jason Bateman? Patrick Bateman. Jason Bateman is the actor. I meant the American Psycho guy. <laughs> this guy definitely sacrificed his life and his personal relationships to afford this house. He definitely bought this house and nobody comes to visit. But goddamn if he isn't happy in his mansion. This is a BoJack house. No home gym is complete without a water fountain straight from your high school hallways. Four million? Okay. I g what? Oh, so this guy is like rich, rich. This is just a retired baller. <laughs> Okay, I get it now. I see why this is on it. Okay, this is a former player millionaire. That's it. Duke lives here. Yeah, this is Duke's house. You know, Duke, the basketball player. Holy shit, this room. Wait, is the living room right there? <laughs> Are you serious? What the... I just saw the, the fountain. The water fountain is right... Are you guys just chilling in here? And you're like, you want to go play some ball? Yeah, but it's so far. Don't worry, I got just the place. If cocaine were a house, the other house was cocaine. Is oh shit, it's a mall. I love mall houses. Take me inside. Yes! This shit is in Miami! I want to live here. I want to live in the mall. Oh, it's beautiful. Indoor trees everywhere. I want it to look like a Hilton lobby. Okay, this is a little weird. <laughs> There's a little bit too much going on here. This is not sorted. We can definitely use some decluttering here. The fireplace in the middle of the wall, into the giant soccer ball, into the stairs, into the rec area over here. I live here. This is my house. Oh my god! This I thought this was like a stage performance area. <laughs> they got a gorilla. This guy? Chilling by the pool? He gets lit up, bro. An aquarium house! <laughs> oh god. Do not commit any crimes in your own home. Not here. I would take one rock. These people are very easy to rob. And you can't even, like, act poor on the inside. Like, have a shitty couch that you get at Goodwill. <laughs> like a 24-inch TV. Like, we don't have any money in here. Don't worry. Don't rob us. It's simply not worth it. I've seen the house. You've got a lot in there. Don't act like you're not living above your means. <laughs> the outside is so modest. Oh, this was all we could afford. Two little t tables and four little chairs. Bullshit. I'm taking everything in this bitch. Big ass shower. Yup. With rocks. Bonsai garden, I think. <laughs> secret couch? Timeout zone. The secret timeout yellow couch that only just fits. These stairs look terrifying. <laughs> Always start with your left foot or else. If you try to start with your right foot, you die. You would have to train yourself for this. Left, right, left, right. There's not even rails until you get halfway up. It gets easier the higher you go. These stairs are a roguelike. Yeah, if I live here, I'm never drinking. And if I, <laughs> I'm jumping, if I'm at the top of there, I'm jumping every time. I'm just gonna jump to the bottom. Fuck it. Worst things will happen if I trip. Left, right, left, right, le okay, it's always left, right. I was gonna say, is it actually left, right every time? Cause all it takes is one fucked up plank to ruin your day. Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, left. Oh, I'm dead. Absolutely unhinged FSBO. Read the overview. Oh, oh God, okay. All right, we have an abandoned property. All right, a lot of junk left behind. I won't answer any questions at all. You can view the house anytime without an appointment. The keys are in a cup in the mailbox. Nobody really cares about the inside anyway. Bring a flashlight for the basement. If you have an offer, text me. I will give you my email address. Otherwise, I won't reply to any questions. The house is unoccupied. It's a free house. He gave me the keys. I have an offer of three million cash on the table. I'm gonna, I, I'm squatting there. And I will sell it back to you for two million. It's my house now. You told me where the keys are. And I have no questions. I will not be answering any texts. It's my house now. I do not care if the house is listed for a thousand days. There's a condo in my NYC building listed for 865 days. I have a lot of money. 
every week some realtor texts me a dissertation about working with him or her. I just delete the text. If you address me as Charles, I'll know you didn't read this listing. Charles is my departed father. Some of you get snippy with me by text. Do not say, do that. I stay up until 3 a.m. I don't work. I inherited wealth. Be nice or I'll call your number at 2 a.m. What the fuck is this? Almost two years on Zillow. Nobody wants to work with this fucking brat. Oh, shit. Big ass house. <laughs> Weird ass. Actually, I fuck with this. I love this. My brain started turning. I love this, actually. This is the indoctrination room. Oh, hell yeah. Anyone for pinball? Foosball, pinball, whatever this is. Okay, we... Did we blow all our budget on the first two rooms? <laughs> it's like the first two rooms, we used all of our money and we got to room three and we're like, oh shit, uh, um, bed, stove, uh, washer, dryer, what do houses need? This is me when I make a Sims house. I do this every time. I make a big ass cool room. I'm like, oh shit, my Sims gotta eat. House on an island, wait. Okay, how, <laughs> if I lived here, if my DoorDash driver is calling me, I'm not picking up. Figure it out, it's your problem, deliver it to me. Hey, where do you live? <laughs> you know where I live. And don't get it wet, either. Get your ass over here. <sighs> if I get one soggy fry, I'm leaving you a one star. You would have to make pilgrimages to do anything. Oh, yes. Oh, dude, the salty bet room. For high-stakes salty bet only, though. Only four people at a time. Betting 800,000 Kony coins on each fight. Why can't I live on an island? Oh, another baller. Indoor hoops. Holy shit, dude. How much? Oh, it's um control room? Oh, it's surveillance. Oh, this is my stream room. <laughs> this is my streaming panic room. I was like, who would be here? This feels like a video editor to me, but no, you're right. It's a surveillance thing. But did I tell you guys about the time Mel and I were looking for our first house and we found a house with an actual surveillance room in it? It was like hidden, but the realtor was like, I have to tell you about this. They asked me not to, but it's, it's in my contract. I have to show you this. And they had like cameras all over the fucking house. And this wasn't in like a wealthy area. It was in like a normal, like middle class suburb. This person was panicking. It was bizarre. Yeah, I live here. Oh, dude, are you fucking kidding me? They have a hovercraft like Diddy Kong Racing. Is this Timber? Does Timber live here? Timber can't afford this. The clock lives here with all of his winnings. TT, maximalist grandma core. I'm so Werther's pilled. Oh my God. I'm, I'm Meemaw maxing. All right, yeah. A lot of kitchen here. I know it smelled crazy in there, but that shit's so comfy. I'm making fun, but she make good waffles though. The breakfast hits different. Oh my god! You ever sleep in a grandma bed that is like, in it like it, it's in the corner of the wall? <laughs> it's not like up against the wall. It's not perpendicular. It goes into the into the corner. Oh, that hits different. I have very vivid memories of sleeping on my grandma's bed like this and watching Babe, the movie about the the pig, on the CRT. Oh, those eggs hit different. Yup, she puts pepper in them. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, dude. The fuck? Grandma did not have this, though, in whatever this Cracker Barrel-ass room is. Too many places to sit, Grandma. How do you choose? Red chair, green chair, blue couch, navy couch. But I don't want to live in Grandma's house. I want to live in the meth mansion. Shall we? Oh, my God. Never mind. I was kidding. I was joking. I don't want to live here. I don't... Well, they're, they're patriotic, though. Now, this is the Resident Evil 7 house. You can't even get to the backyard until six hours in. Outhouse corner. Yep. Fuse box in the potty. Okay. <laughs> All right, man. Don't pee up there. I get. Don't miss. <laughs> uh, oh, a love tub. Okay. Yeah. The heart shaped tub, like at the Poconos. Very romantic. Yay ha! <laughs> a bar. Remember what we said earlier, chat. Anyone with a bar in their house is opulent. That means they're successful and rich. Where are the normal rooms? Where do you live? I feel like I only have half the house here. The rest is DLC. <laughs> we have Disney at home. <laughs> okay. Renaissance themed? Medieval themed? I can see the QR code and the... So we're making it like vaguely medieval. Oh, okay. Never mind. We've gone under the sea, everyone. Into the game room with the SpongeBob chairs. <laughs> the basket room? 
What is, is this supposed to be whimsical? I don't. This is threatening. <laughs> the fireplace. I didn't even notice that. The fake fireplace. That feels like way more work than just a normal fireplace. This is a Toontown house. If you go to Toontown at Disney World, this is what Mickey Mouse's house looks like. Ah, the king's quarters, where the king of the castle rests. And what is this? Ah, for the young duke. The ice cave? This is where I put my bitch wife. Trouble in paradise, I see. Me and the, me and the wife, we're, we're having a fight. Put her in the ice queen's chambers. You cannot live in the bed fit for a king. <laughs> Tell that bitch to cool off. Ah, okay, this is where dad sits. Everybody else sits on the couch, but dad sits over here in this very uncomfortable wood throne. Dad is the king of the Chevy dealership. Wait, the throne is by the TV. I didn't even notice this in the same room. Live in a missile silo. Oh, with pleasure. Do I get the codes? Put me in there. This is where we're going, Chet. <laughs> <laughs> well, how much though? A little cramped, but how much? This doesn't look that bad, unironically. If you gotta manage the silo, might as well, you know, stay there overnight. Blair Witch Core. Let's take a look inside, shall we? <laughs> it's a little on the nose, don't you think? Just his witch above the door. Are you serious? Weird arch with no walkway or anything. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yep, we're going to the top. Let's climb up. Okay. Oh, that's the whole thing. Okay, yeah, don't go up there. Don't go up there. Don't ever find your body. That collapses if you try to camp. Yeah, it's like one of those platforms in, in Mario where if you stand there for too long, it just... Eight beds, seven be... Dude. A mermaid lives here. <laughs> Who doesn't need to eat a lot. This mermaid doesn't need a whole lot of a kitchen. Doesn't need to refrigerate anything. Doesn't have any use of trying to keep meat cold or, you know, keep it free of bacteria. Has a very strong gut, I guess. Yeah, this is in the bedroom. This feels like, yeah, this feels like an AI house. Work from home in your downtown storefront. Dude, unironically, yes. Why not? Why not? Why can't I buy a store? Why can't I live at the mall? If I can afford rent at the mall, why can't I live there? Zoning laws. Yeah, Washington fat cats. If I can afford the rent at the mall, I should be allowed to live at the mall. Oh, there goes Zach again. Out for his morning stroll, walking my dog in the mall. Rent my place right across from Victoria's Secret. Okay, that's not allowed. We, we should have zoning laws for that. You're not allowed to do that. Anyone in Idaho looking to spend $4.5 on a brand new castle? Me, 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 I am! It's my throne room with this bear who I recently felled. He put up a good fight, but I was mightier. Ain't nobody in Idaho got that money. That's why I shall relocate to become king of Ohio. Ida Idaho, not Ohio. <laughs> Too bad you misspoke. Welcome to Ohio. No! It's not a warehouse. It's a ware home. Oh, hell yeah. Put me in there. <laughs> An old-timey car. A jalopy, perhaps. Where you can have some cotton candy, popcorn, and ice cream treats. <laughs> what is this? A, a false park. Another bar. Remember? Affluent. A Coke bar, too, for the kids. An arcade with three golf games? <laughs> ah, two business. Uh, the, okay, so we got two people working very closely together in business. These guys do not have fun. They work a lot. Basketball, but they play hard, too. They play hard just as much. Oh, my God, they got the cryo chamber. Oh, that's a tanning bed. Never mind. Before I, I, before I moved uh, my old place... I went to a gym that had like a cryogenic freezing thing you were supposed to do after you worked out. You guys know what that is? I didn't want to be frozen like Austin Powers for 30 years, so I never did it. Yeah, you get in the ice chamber. <laughs> you get into these ice chambers and they freeze you and it helps your muscles or something. Oh, Rock House! Dude, absolutely. I would live in Arizona in the Rock House. Oh my God, this rules. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I want to boulder right in the living room when you walk in. This would scare the shit out of me. I don't know if I want rocks in the house. Okay, it's here too. Th that's kind of cool though, actually. Uh, 
I kind of like the rock house. All right, I live in the rock house now. This is where I live, and you guys can come stay with me if you subscribe to the channel. If you subscribe, I'll even give you a nice rock for my collection. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Like the video. Check below the video. See if it's lighting up. Like the video. Like the video. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. We found a house. Goodbye. Bye, YouTube. So long.